guys, welcome back to another Ghost Reacts, and today we're reacting to another video, and that video we are reacting to today is a very unusual video, because I don't normally react to these types of videos, but because I'm into my theme parks, especially like Disney, Universal, things like that, um, I'm not interested in Fort Park or uh, Chesington, places like over, that, over here in England, I just don't like them, I don't trust them at all. There are, uh, at least there are some places in Universal and Disney that I can trust to go on and be I feel safe. Um, so the video that we are reacting to today is a new Universal theme park that's coming to Orlando, Florida. Uh, supposedly next year, maybe earlier. Fingers crossed, it's earlier. Um, it is this video we are reacting to today is introducing Dark Universe at Universal Epic Universe. So this is going to be one of the lands in Epic Universe. There's multiple lands. Um, I'll put a picture up on the screen uh, somewhere of the actual outlook of the land itself. If I can find an image. If I can, it'll be on the screen now. Um, there's multiple lands. Um, How to Change Your Dragon. Nintendo Land. Uh, Dark Universe, what we're about to watch in a minute. Um, the expansion of a ministry of magic for harry potter and there is another one but i can't think of what it is um you'll see it on the picture if it's on there um but yeah without further ado let's get into this video today wanted to shake it up a bit so let's get into it is the next theme park for Universal Orlando Resort and will feature five astounding worlds Here we go. that go beyond anything you've ever experienced Our Celestial before. Park is one I missed. In Dark Universe, you'll enter a foreboding world of unearthly legends and monstrous These look experiments. Sick. Uh, to me, just nothing is more universal than the Universal Monsters. The legacy of Universal Monsters is over a hundred years old. Getting to go into the Dark Universe and being able to Invisible be man. in a world in which those monsters are real That's the mummy, I is think, something that Dracula, I have been looking the forward to Maybe Frankenstein. I started with Epic Universe. We made a place for the monster lovers. We made a place for the thrill seekers. In a way, this project, I've been oh. waiting for my whole life. As our guests approach the portal, there's a spire that's crackling with electricity. This is how the dark energy is gathered. This is going to be and so we're sick. See the electricity pulsating through the land and connecting at the top of this manor. To a new world of gods and monsters. Dark Universe is inspired by all the Universal Monster films. This is going to be so good. In our world, all the Universal Monster stories have happened. And Darkmoor is the result of that. Darkmoor. It's the consequence. Every inch of Dark Universe tells a story. You can believe that monsters are real and it's all happening right here. There are layers of intenseness, of scariness in Dark Universe. We kind of toe that line of being family friendly, but we can also be PG-13. Roaming the land, we have some monsters that kind of move around, and then some other characters that help connect you wife. to these stories. Why you can say? actually have yourself made up. He's a monster, like though, a monster, isn't he? Not Frankenstein. And then go out into a monster world. Das Steakhouse is a restaurant that's operated by the familiars of vampires. It's centered around the story of Dracula Ooh. and vampires themselves. People love vampires. As you enter as a guest, you're going to get fed, and you might be scoped out by vampires. We will have steaks on steaks. <laughs> we're creating entertainment for families, and we're creating entertainment for those who want to conquer their fears. This looks so good. And this is just an intro video. Like, they're Person building the this. follows the same story arc as our classic film, The Wolfman. It takes place in an area that's really been taken over and inhabited by our mystics. And you see here the new Maleva. Ooh. And Maleva gives you bad news that you bear the curse of the werewolf. You're immediately put in the wagon and sent out into the woods. This is an incredibly thrilling, family-friendly... It's a bit of a coaster. weird coaster, isn't it? It's it's spinning really coaster. Fun. I can't wait. The Burning Windmill is a classic park 
uh, Universal Monster lore. Mm -hmm. And so when we created the Dark Universe, we knew that we had to create a burning windmill. There's the windmill right in front of you, and suddenly it bursts into flames. This is going to look so sick if they can pull it off Inside properly. Inside the burning blade is a wonderful little tavern, and this is the place where the hounds hang out. The hounds are the monster hunters. Ooh. You'll hear some tales, and their trophies are scattered about. Van Helsing, maybe. That would be a good hunter. It's the hunter, isn't it? Monsters it's the monster is hunter. The most amazing monster ride ever built. We've never opened these doors to Frankenstein Manor. Ooh. The thrills of the attraction, the chance to meet all of our classic monsters in a new and exciting way. Inside Monsters Unchained, the Frankenstein experiment, you're going to see things that defy what you know of. Wait, the whole castle's the dark ride. There's a new resident in Manor. And her name's Victoria Frankenstein. Or well, the manor, should Victoria I say. Victoria Frankenstein is the great-great-granddaughter of Henry Frankenstein. You don't know if Dr. Victoria is good or bad, but she does want to bring good to the name Frankenstein again. Every night inside the manor, Victoria is conducting these experiments. You're going to see that she's captured all of the universal monsters and wanting to control them. Dracula's got other plans. Monsters mm. Unchained has the most technologically advanced animated figures. I think it just looks so built. good. They are visceral, they are powerful, they are intense. The technology we are using is... I hope it looks like this because it looks really sick. every technology I could possibly think of. And then we realized we needed to invent new technology. Imagine what could happen in a monster's ride when this a sense of touch. You'll literally be able to feel characters breathing. What? You want to ride this ride as almost a badge of honor that I can do one of the scariest rides that we've created. Oh my god. We've created some of the most amazing attractions of all time, and we're raising the bar again. I think this universe is going to make the next generation Yo. fall in love with the monsters. To me, Dark Universe is about acceptance. A lot of these monsters, they're the outsiders. They're the ones that are looking for a connection. Dark Universe is for everybody. It's a place where these iconic stories and characters come to life. And for the first time ever, you are a part of This is just the it's one the land. This is just one, and there's more than this. For, for almost a hundred This is just one piece. Monsters are indeed alive, and we can't wait to see your reactions as you come face to face with all of them. Oh my at Universal god, no. Epic Universe. 2025. Hopefully sooner. That's just the f one land, Dark Universe, on its own. There's like multiple lands, as you saw on the map that was in the video, so I might not need to put the map up itself. So, oh my god, man. That is literally just Dark Universe. So, so just from that basis, can, can you imagine what uh, the Harry Potter la uh, land is going to feel like? And uh, the Super Nintendo land and uh, Burke Celestial Park, which is the entrance to the park. Bro, if they do what I think they're going to do, it's going to be mad and mental. Super... Oh my god, can you imagine if Halloween Horror Nights was to go into a uh, dark universe in, in this park? That'd be so sick. I don't think they'll do that because it's not really family friendly for uh, Halloween Horror Nights. Um, but it would be good. Because Halloween Horror Nights is not a staple icon for Universal. It's like one of the must have, the must see events to go to. Oh, because I, I heard that uh, this year's one uh, is going to be themed around um, Ghostbusters, the new Ghostbusters film. There's a house for it, apparently, something like that. Uh, I don't know why. It's not, I don't feel like it's a horror film. It may be a kid's horror film, if you think about it, because it's ghosts, and it? Like, com comedy stance and, all, and all, on the um, film and stuff like that. But yeah, please let me know your thoughts down in the comments if you're looking forward to uh, Epic Universe. Even if it's the first time hearing about it, what are your thoughts on it? I'd love to know your opinion. Um, just from seeing this first uh, portal entrant into Dark Universe, I feel like it's going to be one of the vocal points of the park. I have to go to this park. It's in Orlando as well. I'm, if I go back, I'm, I 
I'm going to go to Universal. And if it's open when I'm there, then I'm going to Epic Universe as well. I don't care. I, I will make it happen. <laughs> I'll do a vlog on it if, if I can. Um, if it actually happens. Fingers crossed. Um, but yeah, if you like this type of content, please smash the like button down below. If you're not a subscriber, then please smash the subscribe button as well. Notification bell to be notified when we didn't upload such as these ones, like reactions, and my gaming videos at the weekend. I know. I, I'm actually trying to get through State of Decay. It's just a lot of looting and upgrading stuff until we get to storyline bases. Um, so I might do some stuff offline until we get to a, uh, like a main bit where I can upgrade to heroes. Uh, the stuff for uh, the people f for the civilization for the hero stuff to go further in the story. Um, but yeah, enough of that. <laughs> Please let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. If you want me to, if they release any more videos of the other universes, what, or the other portals, which I hope they do, so we could get a bit more in-depth uh, look at what's going to be in those parks as well. Uh, please let me know in the comments below if there's any other videos you'd like me to react to on this side for uh, Epic Universe. Um, but yeah, that's all I've got time for today, and I'll see you in my next video. Good bye.